I'm going to be showing you how to properly catheterize a male patient. First, make sure you have all your supplies and calf kit, your sterile gloves, and for me, I use non-sterile gloves just to manipulate the patient, whichever I want, whichever way I want, so I can better access the urethra. So I'll move my patient's legs, spread them out a little bit so I can reach the urethra. Take those off and discard. <clears throat> Open up my calf kit. Then take my sterile gloves. Now open them using the open glove technique because this is a sterile procedure. After I put both of my sterile gloves on, I go through my calf kit and make sure my supplies are there. Make sure I have a towel, tongue, some cotton balls, lube, my solution, and my calf kit, which contains a syringe. First, you lay your sterile towel down in between the patient's legs. This catches any drippage off of the penis so we can catch it and also I put some of my trash up here up down here and up here. First you want to test your catheter. You attach your syringe which is filled with water and you start to inflate the balloon. Make sure there's no leaks and you deflate it. it looks good and you open up your lube, insert the catheter in there, the lube allows it to slide more easily into the urethra, and during this procedure, you gotta have a dirty hand and a clean hand. My left hand will be my dirty hand, I will put the solution over my cotton balls, grab my tongs, in a cotton ball, put in the solution, grab the glands penis or the tip of the penis, and hold on to it firmly. Now circle the glands and get the urethra and dispose. Keeping grip, I go back and get another cotton ball and repeat. Around the glands, over the urethra, and dispose. And one last time, around the glands, over the urethra, and, and discard. Once that's done, you grab your calf, the catheter, place it in between the patient's legs, take the end out of the lube, and insert it into the urethra. Slide it all the way in. And then you inflate the balloon so it holds in place. You remove your syringe, pull out your urethra, and it should get stuck there. And then you dump out your catheter, take off your sterile gloves. And for me, I keep another pair of non-sterile gloves with me so I can put on to lift up the patient's leg and bring the catheter underneath and attach it to the bed. The catheter catches the urine during a long procedure, such as an egg slap. Once this is done, remove all your trash, and the patient is ready to be prepped for surgery.